Hello and welcome to the next instalment of the Daily Devotional from Nottingham City Prayer. My name is David Pyle. I'm the minister of Baseford Road Baptist Church and also part of the City Prayer team. Welcome. I want to share with you in this few moments one verse from Psalm 23 and that is verse 4 which goes like this. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. Everyone acknowledges that we're going through tough and challenging times at this moment with the corona pandemic and our lockdown experience. The psalmist writes these words after he has gone through many difficult challenges, pressures in his life. He thinks about those times and how God has got him through each and every one. And he reflects on some of the tools that God used to lead and direct him. Firstly, there is the rod of God. And the rod is used to attack the wild animals and the beasts that might come after the sheep. So the shepherd can use the rod to defend the sheep and beat off anything that seeks to attack. The staff, on the other hand, is there to lead, to direct, to guide, to pull the sheep towards the direction that the shepherd wants to lead them in. Sometimes when stress and pressure comes to our life, we lift our hands up and throw our heads down and Lord want to wander away from God, thinking that he's failed, he's weak, he's not able to help us. But these words encourage us that the complete opposite is true, that he is strong, he is powerful, he is able to resist any attacks that come to us, but also he is able to lead us and guide us through this testing and challenging time. And for those that know the rest of this psalm, it leads with green pastures, a place of provision, a place of flourishing, a place of rest. God is able to lead us through this time. And so whatever challenges you might face, maybe you're working in the NHS and you're concerned about catching the virus as you serve others, or putting food on the table and keeping a roof over your heads because your income is unsure and unstable at this time. Or maybe you're shut in and you're isolated and you're concerned about your mental health and your well-being. This God, our God, is able to resist the attacks, lead us and guide us, and take us through to that green space. But the psalmist isn't simply drawing strength and confidence from the tools that the shepherd has, but most of all, in the presence of the shepherd himself. It's not the tools in his hand, but it's the shepherd that's the most important element in this. Let us all draw close to God so that he may lead us and guide us through this time. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you that you can lead us and guide us through our deepest and darkest valleys, that we can acknowledge our fears but have confidence in you because your rod and your staff bring comfort to me. And we know that you don't leave us alone. You haven't wandered off, but you're close by us. You're in this dark time together with us. And we can have confidence in you that you will take us through 
to the other side. In Jesus' name, Amen. May God bless you.